Okay, so when I woke up today, I checked Twitter and I saw they released like a second teaser trailer for Sharknado 6, It's About Time. And I don't hate the Sharknado movies. The first one is a big guilty pleasure for me. I own it on DVD and I'm not afraid to say that. I own the first Sharknado on DVD. I don't hate it at all. I mean, I, I, mean, I hate it, but I find so much enjoyment in it and I've seen it many times. It's... It makes for great entertainment. Um, and the second one, I'm just going to say it, I hate that one all around. Third, from memory, was okay. The fourth one was the funnest, was the funnest for me, even though it's ripping off Star Wars Episode Seven. It was still the most funnest installment in that franchise for me. And the fifth, I remember nothing about. And six, we'll see, we'll see about that one. I'll give this one a shot. So let's click play and see if this second trailer impresses me. I won't lie, this looks good. <laughs> but it looks good for all the bad reasons. I mean, this one has dinosaurs. It's ripping off Jurassic Park. It has sharks in it. Um, there's going to be Nazis. There's going to be so much happening in this sixth installment. Plus, it is the last one, so the director really has to do... Like, has to, I hope it just makes a good conclusion chapter to this franchise, if you can call it that, I guess. But, I, I was like, this, this looks good entertainment. This looks like good quality entertainment. It has dinosaurs involved in it now. It has Nazis. And, as always, the Sharknados. And I won't lie, there was actually, there were actually some pretty cool uh, shots in this trailer, like that scene when the bomb went in the shark's mouth and then it exploded, that was cool. Yeah, just, this just looks good entertainment, I mean, I'm definitely going to watch this. It looks like it's also based, like, based in the West, because everybody's wearing, like, cowboy costumes and Western costumes and all that. So, I won't lie, this looks good, and it comes out next Sunday, I think, on the 19th of August. It's coming out It's coming out on my birthday month, same with The Meg, which, that's, like, that is big for me. Like, The Meg's coming out on my birthday month, and it's one of my most anticipated movies of the year. So, I don't know, The Meg's going to be a great birthday present, and I can't wait to see that. Same with Sharknado 6. This looks like a good, bad, quality entertainment. <laughs> Uh, like, I can't wait to see this sixth installment. I cannot wait to see Nazis. I want to see Hitler in this movie. If, it, if it's going to have Nazis, I want to see Hitler. I want to see Hitler get eaten by a shark. <laughs> Alright, won't lie. That would be cool. Won't lie. Um, like, I'm down for the sixth movie. Like, I can't wait, like, I can't wait to review this movie. Um... I mean, I've, I mean, I've watched all the Sharknado movies leading up to the sixth one. I mean, I've watched, um... It took me a couple watches to really suck through the fifth one, but the others I found easy to watch because they're kind of guilty pleasures to me, but not as much as this first one. This first Sharknado is my most biggest guilty pleasure ever. I've seen it so many times. I love it. Because it's literally sharks in a tornado. What? What is there not to love? <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to Sharknado 6. It's a about time, and I love the title. It's so freaking dumb. Like, it's about time. Like, I I, I can see what the director's referencing there. Like, it's about time that this franchise is ending. It's about time, really. It really. Is. Like, one thing that's mind blowing to me is there's more freaking like Sharknado movies and Jaws movies. We only have five Jaws movies. That's if you include Jaws Five, uh, Cruel Jaws, um, and we only, and we have six Sharknado movies. How the hell did that even happen? Oh, like, I don't know, it's mind-blowing to me. But, like I said, I'm down for the sixth installment. It's going to make good good and bad quality entertainment. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to do a review on it and give you my thoughts. Same with the Meg. I can't wait to see that. Um, the, the Meg is a great birthday gift. It comes out in August, which is, it's now, and that's my birthday month. And, yeah. I can't wait to see both of these shark movies. The Meg I'm more excited for because if you haven't seen my Instagram in the past couple months, I've been posting a lot of Meg related stuff on my Instagram. But yeah, I'm very excited for the Meg and it comes out in August which it which is a great birthday present for me. So can't wait to see that. 
Shotgun Six I I'm de I'm definitely down to watch. I'm definitely going to watch this and and do a review on it for you guys. But yeah, so yeah, the question I'm going to leave you with with this video is, what is your biggest guilty pleasure? Uh, let me know that down below. Mine, you, you know what mine is. Yeah, Sharknado. It's dumb, but but I find so much enjoyment in it. I love it. it it's great, really. It really is great. The first one. Um, but for all, all the bad reasons, but makes for great entertainment. But yeah. Um, but anyways, yeah, thank you everybody who watched this video, I appreciate the support you're giving this channel. So anyways guys, um, so yeah, let me know down below, what is your biggest guilty pleasure movie? So yeah, let me know that. But yeah, Sharknado is mine for sure, I mean, yeah. So anyways guys, have a good night everyone, and I'll see you in the next video.